So you want to know how to add a verification bot to your Discord server. This is for all the Discord moderators or just you personally want to start up your own server. I'm going to show you how to do that step by step. I'm not here to waste anybody's time. Let's get straight into it. Now here I have created a Discord server specifically to show you guys tutorials on Discord and in general. Okay, I want to be making these tutorials to help you out if you're a moderator or just want to learn how to build up a server. Now first things first, what I like to do is actually create a bot's role. So what I'm going to do right here is go to the top, go to server settings and go to roles once i am right here i'm going to create a row and i'm going to name it bot okay we're just name it bots right there we're not going to display it nor where we're going to do the mentions so i'm just going to go to permissions and the number one thing you want to do is put administrator on okay now that what this is going to do is allow any bot that you invite to the server to basically do its work and allow it to function correctly so here we are administrators on boss is created all right we're good to go and now we're going to invite the bot to the server now usually what i like to do is go to my own personal server or any other server that has the verification bot already just go over and scroll down till you find the bot section and you actually see the bot right here already it's called pandas guard beta now i personally like this bot it kind of prevents from bots joining your server it's very easy setup and it's easy function to get into the server and verify so this is how i do it okay i go over to the server and i click add to server now for you guys i will have a link down below but if you want to join my server in specific as well and do this i will have the link to my server we're building some crazy things so if you guys want to join that i'd appreciate it other than that we're going to go right here to to add to server just like that you're going to see create commands and server bake a cake and go right here to select server and we're going to go over to we find youtube tutorial so right here we find youtube tutorial going to click on that go to continue and just authorize everything everything's fine do not worry you're not going to get bamboozled now once that is set up you go over to the server and boom okay you see the panzoid guard bot has been added you already see waiting room and verify at the very top already set up for you guys so you're going to want to click on the panzoid guard bot and make sure to give him the bots row okay because if you do not give it the bots row it's not going to function correctly and it's not going to have the right permissions now if you have a server already Already created or you're starting from scratch just like me I recommend you start up a bots command channel so right here we're gonna set up bot commands and we're gonna make that a private chat so nobody else can see it besides me and this is where we're gonna type in the commands and here you're gonna see this whole setup right here okay it says welcome to YouTube tutorial in order to get full access to the server and it is basically already set up for you guys so I'm gonna click on verify right here and it's gonna go continue just like that continue again it's gonna say enter captcha but for you guys i don't personally like typing in the words because if i'm on mobile device you can already see it you always have to go back and forth so i highly recommend the changes which i'm going to show you how to do that but if you are on pc and things like that you can type in the words and boom it says you have been verified so now i go over to my name and boom it gives me the row already and it gives me a new color so just like that this bot already pretty much just gives you the row gives you the verification you don't really have to set up a role you don't have to do any of that so that's basically how you implement the bot into the server but you are not done yet any other channel that you create you want to make sure that only that specific role can see it so right here where it says text channels we're going to go over to edit category go to permissions and as you can see it's already on everybody but we're going to put it to a private category we're going to put right here it says add role we're going to put the verified role to basically be able to view every single channel so i'm going to click on save changes and just like that if somebody ran randomly joins your server they will only be able to see these two channels right here they will not be able to see everything else until they verify so once you verify you have full access to the server and just like that is that simple so same thing with the voice activation right here or voice channel uh, we're gonna private categorize that at the verified bot uh, or verified raw mints view channels save changes and boom so now if i invite anybody to the server all they're gonna see is the verify system so they're gonna have to verify no matter what me personally like i said i don't recommend the waiting room so i'm just gonna delete that now here's another tip all right in order to make this work all the time you have to keep the bots role very at the top and make sure nothing is above it now what i want to do is change it to an image now let me give you an example so we're gonna go over back to the bot command right here by clicking on slash and you're gonna see all these commands okay do not get confused now just again I'm gonna type in config and it's gonna pop up all the configurations so right here it says config capture so this is what we're gonna click on right here I'm gonna click on that and it's gonna show you these options image and text now we already have the text option I personally do not recommend it because like I said if you're on mobile it is a struggle to always have to verify and click back and in just to try to get the text so we're gonna click on image catch up right here and just type in enter and just like that it's been added updated that simple now let's make our way back over to the verification I'm gonna remove my row so that it can restart the whole system so click on verify click on continue 
click on continue again and now it shows up an image instead of the text it shows up an image of the moon so we're gonna click right here and it's gonna be a moon so if you're like small brain and don't know what the hell this is of course you're gonna get it wrong so just click on moon and boom you are verified easy peasy so yeah that's just some of my recommendations whenever you're trying to do this it's very important that you set it up easy for the consumer to join your server and not have to be struggling to try to get in but yeah that's really it for today's video i hope you guys did enjoy this how to add a verification bot to your server this one in my opinion is the best one because it kind of protects it from any bots it doesn't really allow too much spam in it and if you're into nfts and crypto you know you want to make sure you have the best bot into your server and i highly recommend this one kiss you all on your forehead and you guys go make that bread